generally, today I want to tell you the six parts of a lady that she would want you to touch, but she will never tell you. Please, honey, can you, can you touch me here? Like, she will never tell you that touch here. Like, I feel I want you to touch me here. So, those parts generally are always touched or you can always touch them. If you're with a person that you are truly attracted to or someone that you love most, it might be your partner, it might be someone that you are sexually attracted to. So before you go to bank, you want to immediately, maybe you touch her boobs and you touch another part and you want to pa 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 pa. It's not romantic at all. So I'm going to discuss with you six parts of a lady that she wants you to touch, to turn her on, but she will never tell you. Join me in this video and let's learn. Men, let's learn. This video is meant for you. Number one, number one, the ears, the ears. So when you're holding your partner and you're in this kind of quiet moment together, you're having fun, you're trying to make love, and you're trying to kiss, make sure, do not forget to kiss the ears. You see, like this, almost the edges of the ears, those parts really turn a woman on. And some of us do not know, like, we just want to kiss on the lips and, uh, and that's all. We forget that they are also sensitive. These ears are also sensitive. And trust me, they can turn a woman on. Number two. Her neck. The neck region. This lower part of the neck. So if you're trying to kiss a woman and you're on the lips, do not try to prolong the, the kissing of the lips. You know, because too much of anything is always bad. And when you try to prolong the kissing of the lips, then it becomes tasteless. You know, when you begin kissing, it is so sweet. And when you prolong it, if you're not going to venture in other areas, then it becomes it becomes boring and your partner will say no it's boring maybe she will try to push it out but try to even slope down on the neck region and kiss you know she will be turned on number three her hair her hair most of the ladies once you touch in her hair and you try to massage her scalp, you will see her losing her mind over you. And she will be turned on. Trust me. She will be turned on. Because you don't want to be that kind of person who wants to go, maybe you're going to have the smiley moment you're going to make love to your partner and you want to be this kind of person who comes and just bangs pa, 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 and you go you will be a boring partner and your partner will be like what, what happened to this man like he's not romantic at all because for you you just want to open the door bang bang and move out you know you have not gone on an adventure of seeing wh what is there in these streets of the body 
before you go down to bang, you need to first appreciate her body. And trust me, by the time you go to enjoy anything down there, she will all be yours. Number four, that people didn't know. Number four, we have the feet, her feet. So, oftentimes when people, like most ladies, have come from work and they are really very tired, they just want to relax. And as a man who is romantic, you come first rub your hands very well, warm them, and remove her shoes, try to massage the feet and her toes. Of course, most of them would try to laugh because they are not used of someone massaging their feet. But in the long run, she's being turned on. And you continue to enjoy the time you have together with her. Number five. Number five. Between her thighs. So, generally, this is the most delicate part which is very soft and very warm it is very sensitive so before you go in do whatever kind of business you want to do <laughs> in how what before you go in please make sure your hands are smooth Try to touch and massage between her thighs softly and gently, you know, softly and gently as you're trying, of course, to kiss her, to do other kind of things, you know, I have already talked all of them, then you are trying to turn her on and trust me by the time you go to explore her world she will already be happy to welcome you in so that you can enjoy move on an adventure of entering all the walls of jericho and know what's in her world and lastly her lips. Don't think I forgot the lips. Her lips. We need to learn how to kiss well. Some people might go to kiss and as if he's trying to swallow an egg. Those are lips of your babe. Those are lips of your girlfriend whom you want to turn on. So do not go to kiss as if you're trying to bite maybe hard corn. You need to be romantic and do it in a perfect way. Remember, if you're going to do all this, you need to be smelling good. Smell good, my man. Smell good because once you are smelling good, I mean, maybe buy a deodorant, buy, buy a perfume, and like body spray yourself. Try to smell good because some women will even be turned on by a mere smelling, sniffing you actually. If you are with her and she's sniffing you, she's like, 
this is the man I'm comfortable with. This is the man I really wanted just because of your smell. So, my dear brother who is out there who was wondering how you can turn your woman on those parts. Before you go to explore her world, you can do that. And I promise you, she will be turned on. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Robert. If you haven't subscribed, please remember to subscribe. Click on the notification bell so that in case we upload a video, be ready to watch it and see it first. Thank you so much and bye.